Hello, here is your Montana weather hazards briefing. For updates, please visit the National Weather Service webpage or contact any of the Montana National Weather Service offices. Here is a look at the potential hazards for the week. Strong winds are expected mainly along the northern Rocky Mountain front, with widespread gusty winds across the remainder of the state through Wednesday. There may be potential impacts to outdoor medical or recreational tents, as well as the potential for unsecure objects being blown away. There is elevated fire weather potential through Tuesday for lower elevations east of the Continental Divide, with this afternoon and Tuesday seeing the highest potential given the widespread gusty winds and low relative humidities. Under these conditions, there is the potential for burns to become uncontrolled and spread. Thunderstorms are possible over western and central Montana Monday, becoming more widespread across the state by the end of the week. This creates the potential for new fire starts caused by lightning. Here are the current hazards across the Treasure State. Glasgow's area, as well as Hill and Blaine counties, are currently under a red flag warning through early this evening. Here is the latest drought monitor. Please pause this slide for further review. Snow water equivalent remains well above normal for north central Montana for this point of the season, with near average snow water equivalent over southwest Montana. The seven day precipitation forecast shows the heaviest amounts are forecasted to fall over the western and central, south central portions of Montana, while lighter precipitation is forecast for most of the plains across the state. Here is a look at the peak wind gusts through the middle of the week. The strongest winds are expected along the northern Rocky Mountain front Monday afternoon. Otherwise, Widespread gusty conditions will persist across much of the state through Wednesday. Here is a look at the relative humidity values for Tuesday, ranging from the mid-teens to the mid-twenties. Along with previously mentioned gusty winds, the combination of these conditions have caused elevated fire weather concerns. Wednesday looks to be the warmest day this week, with temperatures ranging from the mid-70s to mid-80s across central and eastern Montana. These warmer temperatures could cause stream and river rises with increased snowpack melting. Here is a look at the Climate Prediction Center's 6 to 10 day climate outlook. There are equal chances for warmer or cooler than average temperatures, with slightly above normal chances over parts of eastern Montana. There are above normal chances for above average precipitation across the entire state through the period. Now here is a look at the Climate Prediction Center's 8 to 14 day climate outlook. There are equal chances for warmer or cooler than average temperatures and above normal chances for above average precipitation across the entire state throughout the period. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please contact your local National Weather Service Weather Forecast Office for further information.